Welcome back this morning. Sarah Spivey and David Sears are out at Anne Frank Inspire Academy for Science with Sarah. So they are hanging out with a group of second graders and today they are making soda bottle tornadoes. Good morning, guys. Yes, good morning. We are making soda bottle tornadoes. David, he doesn't need the safety goggles or the gloves, but he's, he's so science, he's gonna do that. And I'm proud of you, David, way to go. Okay, today we are going to be making soda bottle tornadoes with a twist. We're gonna put food dye in our soda bottles but only one of ours is going to have soap in it. And we're going to figure out, okay, which tornado will be easier to see? The one with soap or the one without soap? Who gets the soap? You or me? Uh, you can pick. What would you like? Oh, no, we'll think about it. Okay. So the first thing to do is to get two soda bottles. You want to make sure all of the plastic is off of the soda bottle. So even this little guy. Now, I have a little tool here. I think, there you go, David. Just go for it. Um, maybe he uh. did need the safety goggles after all. Um, <laughs> And then you're going to fill up one about two-thirds of the way with water. So let's do that, David. Which one do you want to be filled up with water? I like this one. Okay. While you're doing that, I'm going to How put much? about two-thirds of the way. While you're doing that, I'm going to put food dye in my water. You need food dye, too, but I'll let you pick what color. And when you do this, you're only going to do a couple of drops because you still want to see the tornado. All right? Great job, David. That should be good. What color would you like in your tornado? I want. Do you have blue? I have blue. Okay, great. Okay. There you go. Right. A couple of drops in there. I'm also going to put a little glitter in there just so that we can see the tornado a little bit better. So I'm just putting a skosh. Did you like that word? A skosh, skosh? of glitter. How much is a skosh? Just a bit. A little bit. How much is a pinch? A scope? Yeah. What's about bigger, that. a scope or a pinch? Oh, you got, you have got gold glitter. Color. Okay. The next thing you need is you need a tornado connector. Now, these tornado connectors you can find on Amazon. They're like ten cents each. You're going to make sure it's really screwed on tight there. I all have my tornado connector too. Make sure it's screwed on really tight. Whoa! Oh, hey. Oh my. Yep. That's why you need to use a little safety, I guess. But a little water everywhere doesn't hurt anybody. Oh, the other thing you're going to do, David, is you're going to put a little... Did you want soap in there? Or oh, yeah. No, no we'll do some soap. Okay. Make, put some soap you in there. You know what about cleanliness? Cleanliness is next, next to, to godliness. godliness. You're going to put a lot of soap in there. Soap so in there. yours is going to have the soap, soap, and mine is not. You're also going to okay. screw this on on the top here. Okay. Really good. Okay? Really tight. You want to do it really tight because you don't want to do what Sarah did and spill the water everywhere. No spillage. Okay, so yours has soap in it. Watch this. You turn it over and you and you do it like that and you can oh, watch what happens. It's a tornado. Whoa! Okay, you see Ooh. that? How that tornado is formed? Can you uh -huh. see that clearly, David, with yes. the glitter kind of acting like debris? Wow. Okay, cool. cool. Let's try yours with soap in it. Soap in it. What happens? With okay. Soap. And then go like that. Take it up a little bit. Oh, you did not make sure yours was tight enough, well, did it's you? It's leakage. Okay, let's see. Here we go. So the soap is not creating a tornado. The soap will create a tornado. Oh, it's it just going to be a little bit more difficult to see because there's oh, there more it goes. debris. There goes. Yeah, a there little goes. bit more difficult to see because there's more debris. And the way, the reason I wanted to show this is whenever we have tornadoes here in San Antonio, they're usually rain wrapped. They usually have a lot of rain. They're a little bit more so difficult to see. There's rain around the tornado. That's exactly. why you can't see it so well. So the best place to be is inside and away from windows. Guys, are y'all ready to do Let's this experiment and All test right. out? Yeah! We will do that right when we come back from commercial break. So we gotta wait a little bit longer. Did you bring a towel? <laughs> All right, welcome back to Science with Sarah. We're at Anne Frank Inspire Academy, Northwest Military. What are we making, guys? Tornado! Yeah, okay, so flip yours over and spin it. Okay, do you guys have soap or not? No. Not soap. No soap. So spin it around a little bit. Here we go. I don't see any tornado. We'll help you. Did you have soap or no soap? No. So. Soap. So we're going to see here. Keep it going. All right, there it goes. <laughs> It's going to turn into a tornado. Spin it around a little bit. There we go. There Look we at go. that. Look at that. There it goes. There Whoa. That's really fast. So you guys You're said food so color tornado will be easier to see. Yeah. So you don't have soap in you. So what do you think? <laughs> it is, that is so cool. The glitter is like. Yeah. The glitter makes it show up. Awesome. Yeah. It's All right. This one is great. Great. So this was no soap, right? Yep. Okay, would you guys like to try your tornadoes? Yeah. 
Okay, flip it over and spin it. Flip it over. Flip it over. Spin it. Don't let home face. Soap or no soap? No soap. No soap. No soap. Whoa. So, oh, look at that. Whoa. Wow. It's, it's warming. Whoa, I love that you guys can see. We have soap in here, right? Yeah. But can you see how the glitter is going What did you around? say? Food coloring and soap or food coloring by itself? By itself. By itself? That's what y'all decided? Yeah. No, wait. That's air. So why do you think the food coloring is easier to see without the soap? Because there's, like, less stuff to block it. You know, like, soap causes bubbles. And the bubbles just block it. Yeah, see, theirs isn't quite as fast as yours, so they had soap in there. Okay. But they got some nice bubbles in there, though, don't they? What do you think about your bubbles? Here we go. Tomato. All right, here we go. Soap or no soap? Emily. No soap. No soap. And look at your tornado. Before, before it was always leaking, and now it's not. Soap or no soap? Soap. soap. You had soap, so it's going to be a little more difficult to see, right? Yeah. Well, that looks like a root beer float you got going there, to be honest with you. Look at yours. I'm guessing that you did not have soap in yours. Yeah, we didn't. You had soap in yours? No. No, they you did, did not have soap in yours. They had soap in yours. So what's the difference? I don't know. Whoa. Whoa. Look at you the You can see yours one. better than you can see theirs, right? But you can see it. Look at the, look at the sparkle. Wow. Yeah. So, soap or no soap? Pretty good experiment, huh? You could actually do it again. Hey, look at that. Keep on doing it. Okay. So that's the soapy one. This is the non-soapy one. You know how I know? How do you know this is the soapy one? Other than the fact that she put soap in it. Because it has Whoa! Look at all the bubbles coming down. Turn it over. Turn it around a little bit. Off we go. Look at that. Hold it right there. Hold on to it so it doesn't fall. Look at that tornado. Whoa. So we have to go. We had it so. What's the difference between the soap and the no soap? I feel, I feel like what I, I've been looking at other people's with, with the soap, and I, and I feel like there's bubbles coming out of like the top one. Uh -huh. Like, but I don't know why that's not happening with ours. You don't know why it's not what? Happening with ours. Because this is yours. Yeah, you don't have as many bubbles. Oh. There's a lot of soap in there. All right, one more time. Great about this experiment. All right, hold on to it. Flip it back and forth. Uh, hold on to it. it hold on to it. Grab the bite. There you go. Well, you got a little leakage going there. We'll wipe that up. All right. If you can hear my voice, clap once. Look at that. How fun was this experiment, guys? So much fun, right? So was your hypothesis right or wrong? Is it okay if it was wrong? Yeah, but. Wasn't this fun? Yeah. Okay, everybody, go ahead and wave to your parents back at home. Check out more Science with Sarah on ksat.com. Another, <laughs> another great one. Love yeah, that, that experiment. That was super cool. <laughs>